All right. By request, I'm going to give you a little uh, rundown on my correct compressor that I just received from Mr. Joe Broncado at Air Tanks for Sale. Um, <clears throat> this is pretty much how it comes uh, right out of the crate. The only thing I had to do here is uh, I had to install the uh, oil breather cap and I mounted my alpha filter. Uh, other than that, um, I had to take it out of the box. That's it. Uh, so here I've got the line going to my, uh, my air tank over here. And I've had this thing running and it's already been pressurized. Um, but what I wanted to show you first was here, uh, we got an hour meter and I've got just over nine hours on this now. And uh, when I received it, it had four and a half hours on it, which I like. I like that uh, somebody went and took the time and did a proper break in on this and made sure that when I uncreated it, I wasn't going to have any issues. And I haven't. So thank you. Uh, much appreciated. So uh, one of the things that's really nice is uh, you can see here, right, this main gauge is reading zero. Right now I've got um, the auto shutoff set for 3,500 PSI. Uh, over here, this is the, the outlet from the compressor. Comes around and comes into our alpha filter. And you can see here, that also is reading zero. But if I come over here to my, uh, my air tank, right, it's not zero. That's a wonderful thing. Something you're uh, not going to see on your uh, lower quality, uh, lower priced compressors, right? We've got a check valve in here. Right here, this guy. So if anything happens, if I accidentally open a valve, I don't, I'm not going to lose any air that I put into this cylinder. God bless you. Love that. All right, so this guy's already warmed up. It's only been turned off for as long as I've been speaking. So let's turn it back on. And uh, I'm going to make sure that... The, Low side drain is open. Just start it up. Now let's run for just a couple seconds here. But because it's already warm, um, I'm going to close this valve now. And let's start building pressure. This is as loud as this compressor ever gets, which is a beautiful thing. I remember running my YH, but you couldn't even talk to somebody in the same room, literally. And uh, Dakota, if you're out there, you know exactly what I'm talking about. <clears throat> We've had many a conversation, <laughs> missed many a conversation, filling bottles with a YH. So, here we go. We've got a uh, little pressure here. And, um, so, one of the, uh, the great features, right, you mentioned already, is the auto shut-off. So, when uh, our pressure gauge reaches uh, the needle I set over here, I can change that. Right? If I push this guy down, I can actually move the shut off point. Go wherever I want. Come around here. Put it back to 3500. Just for the sake of uh, our demonstration purpose here. So that's going to shut the, shut the compressor off all by itself when it reaches whatever the target pressure is that I've set. The other wonderful thing is right here, the auto condensate drain. No more babysitting your compressor. This is completely hands-off operation. So right now I've got this set at, um, we'll open, when the valve opens, it opens for one second, and here I've got it set for about 35 minutes. So every 35 minutes it's going to open the condensate drain for one second. And, and it's completely adjustable. So, still building pressure here. We are doing fine. So, uh, this is the air inlet here. So, you want to make sure you keep this uh, unobstructed. And I've given this a nice work, wide berth here. You know, plenty of, uh, plenty of air, nothing obstructing it. But the fan is actually right down here. This is the fan right here. It's blowing up the entire unit off. Let's take our alpha filter pressure gauge here. Okay. That's not going to come up. That only just starts coming up when you get to 2200 PSI. But here we go. We are at 3,000. You know, really the last, the last thing I wanted to show is this. You would never try doing this on the tiny compressor. This is the high side piston right here. Look at that. This is the high side output. I dare you to try that on your YH. Look, burns all over. And there we go. That's it. 
That little, that little beep right there means it has reached its auto shut off. It shut off at 34.50. And that's it. So, it's a beautiful thing. No more sitting around, no more babysitting, which means more trigger time. More trigger time equals happy air gunners. All right, thanks guys.